Elected in a by-election in 2012, Gwen Johansson took office in 2013 and has been the mayor of Hudson's Hope for three years. In this time, she has been vocal about her disapproval for the Site C Dam and passionate to get Hudson's Hope more known to the rest of our province. It was just before the Christmas holidays that she received a call from BC Business Magazine saying that she was chosen as one of the 35 most influential women in British Columbia. I laughed and said, you know, I don't know who would have suggested my name to you as being influential. And she just laughed and said, well, your name was brought forward. And so that was the way it came to me. And, so, and it sounds like you were surprised. Oh, I was very surprised, yeah. Her modesty is obvious, as she hasn't even shared the news with some of her co-workers, but of course some of them found out on their own accord. Mayor Johansson looks at this as an opportunity to get the word out on Hudson's Hope, as it's not just Site C that they want to talk about. Well, the media seems to have picked up on, on the Site C thing, but there are a number of things that, you know, that Hudson Hope, like we do have a vision of where we want to take the community as a council. And, uh, you know, we want to have a stable, independent uh, community that, you know, can stand on its own feet and um, have a, a goal that we're trying to work towards. And, and, you know, we are branded as the playground of the peace, so we want a diversified economy. And so the playground of the peace, we attract a lot of tourists in the summertime. For that reason, they are planning to build an RV park at the Peace Canyon Dam by Dinosaur Lake, just six kilometers southwest of Hudson's Hope. There's a new find, uh, or relatively new, um, a paleontology find, of a trackway, dinosaur trackway. Just outside their boundaries to the west of the Williston Reservoir. This summer, paleontologist Rick McRae and his wife plan to do exploratory work in the area. As they have said, this has world-class potential for a third dinosaur exhibit in the piece, going along with Tumbler Ridge and Wembley. We'd like to develop the agriculture That's because it's stable and, um, and food security is becoming a greater and greater issue. She shares that because of their microclimate in the Peace Valley, this provides optimal conditions for cantaloupe and watermelon to grow. The taste is amazing and it's so different between that which is grown and brought in from, you know, the, the southern part of the area. So uh, whether we can duplicate that or not, I don't know because those are, there's four large alluvial flats that um, are, will, will be inundated if this dam you know, does come to fruition. Mayor Johansson also touched on how important it is for young women to follow their dreams as the world now offers so many options as opposed to her youth. Years ago when I was coming out of high school you know you could be you could be a nurse you could be a teacher you could be a telephone operator you don't even have those anymore and you know there's some um, and you could be a secretary so you know there weren't a lot of choices but now you can choose to be anything and that's I think the, the message. Reporting for Go on Shaw TV, I'm Emily Moyes.